700 million. He broke it all down for everybody. Signing with the Dodgers, it has been quite the last few days in the game of baseball. But uh, he himself made the announcement. That is a superstar for you. $700 million breaking it down to go to the Los Angeles Dodgers. Was there ever a doubt Shohei was going to the Dodgers? Yes, there was a doubt at points throughout the offseason, but got it done. $700 million again is a number that I keep saying in my head because I just can't possibly believe it. It was the Cubs. It was the, it was the Blue Jays in play. It was the Dodgers. The Braves were there. But ultimately, it came down to being the Dodgers where Shohei announced it via his Instagram where he said, to all the fans and everyone involved in the baseball world, I apologize for taking so long to come to a decision. I have decided to choose the Dodgers as my next team. First of all, I would like to express my sincere gratitude to everyone involved with the Angels organization and the fans who have supported me over the past six years, as well as to everyone involved with each team that was part of this negotiation process, especially to the Angels fans who supported me through all the ups and downs. Your guys' support and cheer meant the world to me. The six years I spent with the Angels will remain etched in my heart forever. And to all Dodgers fans, I pledge to always do what's best for the team and always continue to give it my all to be the best version of myself. Until the last day of my playing career, I want to continue to strive forward, not only for the Dodgers, but for the baseball world. There are some things that cannot be conveyed in writing, so I want to talk more about this again at a later press conference. Thank you very much. What does this mean? Well, it means Shohei Otani is the highest paid athlete in North American sports ever in history and it wasn't even particularly close we can see here um, that patrick mahomes was the second closest here's the list here aaron judge is at five 360 million mookie betts is four mike trout is three 427 million patrick mahomes the best football player on the planet at 450 million dollars and coming in now at the top of the list a quarter of a billion dollars further away from the second closest athlete, Shohei Otani, 700 million. Let that set in. A quarter of a billion dollars more than the next closest contract. That is crazy. Then the baseball world. Obviously, we saw some other names on that top five list. Mike Trout below him, Mookie Betts, Aaron Judge, Mike Trout, uh, still about 270-some million dollars away from where Shohei Otani is at this point. So his contract, let's break it down for a second because you hear $700 million and think, wow, how, how is this going to work for the Dodgers? Well, first off, Ken Rosenthal uh, reported this first. There's unprecedented deferrals in this contract. The majority of his salary, the deferrals were actually Shohei Otani's idea to ease the Dodgers' luxury tax and cash flow burdens to give the team the flexibility needs to be as competitive as possible. So what does that mean specifically? Well, $700 million over 10 years, essentially, to everybody that is trying to do the math, means, wow, $70 million a year. Well, that's not exactly how this is going to work. And that's where this benefit comes into play for the Dodgers. And that's why Shohei, who wanted this and was a big reason this is happening, it's his idea, was to alleviate the burden for the Dodgers, to make it so they can still go out and sign guys. So they still can go get some much-needed pitching for this season. Maybe even Yamamoto, who's still on the market. So instead of it being $70 million a year for the Dodgers to pay, it's not going to be near that much because of the burden, because of what he did with the deferrals for this contract. So this deal, look, I, this is a deal where everyone will remember where were you when Shohei Otani announced his signing? It's just going to be one of those moments in sports history forever. I sure as hell know where I was. I was on a boat going on a, a Christmas holiday. Got off the boat to come in studio to do this emergency podcast. And that, that is something that I, I, I feel like everyone will be able to remember. Um, it's the biggest free agent signing in sports history. And I, I was saying this before. 
what is what what does this offseason mean? What does this mean for Shohei? He's the the biggest free agent in sports history. And and now he's signing the biggest free agent deal in sports history. And and people will hear that number, 700 million, and scratch their heads. And what they're going to say is, there's not an athlete that's worth that. How is he worth $700 million? How is the baseball player, Shohei Otani, worth $700 million? Well, let me explain. One, I personally believe the baseball player is worth that. You're getting two players in one, right? All those players we just talked about, Mike Trout, Mookie Betts, Aaron Judge, who are in the top five biggest contract in North American sports. Well, those are one player. Shohei is two players all in one. But aside from that, what this means for the Dodgers specifically going forward, what this means for the game of baseball, that's 700 million number. You, you can't, I, I truly don't believe you can put a number on that. You could have paid the guy a billion dollars, and I would have said Shohei is worth it for what he brings to an organization, what he brings to, he brings an entire country along. He brings an entire, he brings jersey sales. He puts fans in seats, all of that. There is not a number that I don't think Shohei would have made this worth. Thanks for watching. If you love flipping bats, swinging 3-0, or just talking ball, join us. Call us at 213-537-9339 with your questions. We have a weekly guest, and we have a lot of fun, so hit that subscribe button.